In order to help you to act efficiently on your patient's posture and movement, the Kinepod Laboratory has designed a completely new generation of active therapeutic tools. These accessories include the Kinepod insole, the active oral orthosis and the active ocular plate. These tools are made with care and precision from quality materials and can be used in the following applications. Performance, balance, re-education, prevention, maintenance. In order to use these tools correctly, I propose a few tests on posture and movement that will enable you to evaluate the therapeutic needs of your patients. The patient is standing, eyes closed and arms outstretched. He stays in this position for 30 seconds. At the end of the exercise, both hands should end up at the same level, in perfect symmetry. Arms outstretched, the jaw loose and eyes closed, the patient takes 50 steps on the spot while lifting his knees 45 degrees. During this test, the patient should not turn horizontally by more than 20 or 30 degrees. The patient positions his arms upright. In this exercise, the two hands should be positioned at the same level. The patient must maintain contact between the thumb and the index finger. The therapist tries to separate them. In this test, the strength applied should be the same on both sides, and it should be difficult to separate them. With arms outstretched, the patient crosses his hands. The therapist applies vertical pressure to try to unbalance the patient. This test can be carried out from in front or from behind and should be repeated twice to avoid any effect of surprise. In this exercise, the patient should not lose his sense of balance. Positioned behind the patient, the therapist, with arms outstretched, puts his hands on the patient's shoulders. The patient turns his head as far as he can and indicates the limits of his field of vision to the therapist. In this test, the patient should easily see half of the therapist's face. The therapist positions his hands on the pelvis, with his thumbs on the iliac spine of the patient. The patient bends over. In this test, the therapist's thumbs should be positioned at the same level. If these tests are not convincing, the various Kinepod active therapeutic tools are sure to be able to offer real help to your patients, thanks to their re-educative particularity. In addition, a few minutes of exercise every day should be sufficient to ensure that the beneficial effects of these tools on posture are lasting. To find out more about our active therapeutic tools and for information on our specific training courses, visit our site at www.kinepod.com.